So the 2022 World's Strongest Man is getting closer and it's getting exciting. And the World's Strongest Man have just announced how you can get VIP tickets to this year's show. This is the first time that World's Strongest Man have ever had VIP tickets mm. for people to come and watch the show. And it sounds really exciting. Lizzie has all the information for you. VIP tickets then. What does being a VIP ticket holder entail? So it gets you access to a dedicated viewing deck. The best seats in the house come with a VIP ticket. It also includes all of your food and drink for the days that you are there. Big deal, I think. I would like that. Yes, I would, that would make a big difference to you, <laughs> but to a lot of people as well. And probably most importantly, VIP tickets get you meet and greets with the current athletes and the legends that attend World's Strongest Man. So this is, I think this is a very big deal for World's Strongest Man to do something, a more fan immersive event, because I mean, Yes, you have to pay, obviously, their VIP tickets. I would rather pay for that experience than turn up for free for the old World's Strongest Man fan experience. Oh, absolutely. I mean, there's no comparison. You know, things have been moving and improving over the last few years. This is a real big step forwards yeah. to make it a, a proper fan experience. I've had messages and people kind of talk to me about is World's Strongest Man worth coming to watch, blah, blah, blah. And I've always in the past said, to be honest, you're better off watching it on TV because it's a great TV production. But if you wanted the Strongman experience, you're probably better off going to the one-day shows. Yeah. This is the first time World's Strongest Man are bringing the fans in and giving them a, a, a fun experience to kind of go away with, to meet all your favourite athletes and to really feel like you're involved. But there's more also. There's more. So there is also the fan festival. So there's going to be a dedicated area. Now this area is free for everyone. This is super cool. Yeah, this is a dedicated area where people can go in between the events because we know there's a lot of downtime at World's Strongest Man. And it's going to have stalls and vendors and giveaways and food trucks and all sorts of stuff going on there. So there will be places for people to go and things for them to do in between events. Now there is also going to be free general admission which will be on a first come first serve basis. So this is obviously only VIP tickets that people are paying for. General admission will be free and there will be viewing area but it's not going to be the fancy viewing deck that the VIPs uh, get to sit in stand in whatever that looks like now let's talk price how do you put a price on this experience <laughs> for the VIP tickets it's going to be somewhere around $250 a day for the event days the qualifying and, days yes yep. for the qualifying days and then for the final days $350 or you can get a full five day pass, which will get you into every com day of competition for $1,300. Now, it is quite a lot of money. As a fan, as a mega fan, I would pay it, <laughs> but you know, I like to shop. <laughs> so I'm probably not the best person to talk about that. I think if you're, if, if you're in a position and you really want the opportunity to meet all the athletes, have an incredible time and experience and come away from World's Strongest Man really feeling like you're a part of it, I think mm. it's an amazing opportunity. Yes. And we shouldn't lose sight of the fact that there will be free general admission as well. I actually think World's Strongest Man is going to be stacked with fans this year. I okay. think there's going to be loads. And this is, you know, you've got to remember, you just go back a few years ago, I was competing in the middle of nowhere in front of nobody at World's Strongest Man. Mm -hmm. I've done car parks at World's Strongest Man out in the back of the wilderness, you know, and you literally have, like, do you remember the yoke I did against the Drunus? And there's just like yeah. you and a few other people cheering on. Unbelievably, that was in LA. I know. It wasn't like in some remote country but it's, somewhere. But it's great to see how the growth of the sport is, is mm. helping it all get bigger. World's Strongest Man now actually wanting to involve the fans, which I think is amazing. It's really cool. Um, and they, they've, there's a lot of things coming up with Worlds. Yeah. Um, and we will be involved in a way. Yes, yes, we're going to have our own little part to play. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, this year, we won't be able to get to World's Strongest Man. No. But next year, we're going. Okay. 100%. Deal. I think these VIP tickets are going to sell out really, really quickly. So go over to theworldstrongestman.com. If you buy your tickets before the 1st of April, you can get a 10% discount using the code WSM22VIP. So we also have a little map here where you can see number five is where the competition area will actually be. Number four is the VIP viewing deck. And then number three is the fan festival. I feel that these are the three most important parts of this map. That and the toilet. <laughs> For a strong man. Very important. Gross. <laughs> 
But no, this is going to be an amazing opportunity. Uh, I, I would love to be out there this year. Unfortunately, we can't, but next year we will. But if you get the opportunity and you want to go, make sure you head on over to the World's Strongest Man website and get your tickets early. 